Welcome to a creepy crawly nightmare. In this video, we will be showing you how you can crawl your way into a fun new tribe for Commander. Ishkana the Graph Widow emerges from the shadows to lead an army of spiders. Yes, you heard me, spiders. Those creepy crawly little critters. Oh, why are we doing spiders? Why does it have to be spiders? <sighs> fine, fine, I guess we're doing spiders! Okie dokie then! Anyway, let's talk tribal for a quick moment. When you're building a tribal deck that's focused on one specific race of creatures like say goblins or elves or in this case spiders, we need to keep one important thing in mind. We need to be strategic in our choices of cards. While it might be a neat idea to take all of your favorite spiders and just shove them into a deck under legendary spider Ishkana, rarely will that give you a successful deck. You need to think past the tribe as a whole and focus on what each individual card will be bringing to the table. You need to look at each creature and ask yourself, well, what does this card contribute to the overall deck? Will this card be useful in more than one situation? Next, let's look at the spiders as a tribe. Spiders more often than not have reach, meaning that while they do not necessarily have flying, they are able to block creatures that have flying. Some spiders have death touch, which is another useful ability to have, and many of these creatures have a very high toughness compared to their power, which has led many people to refer to spiders as big butt spiders. And it's the ability of each of these spiders beyond these factors that will help us determine whether or not it would be worth running them. So let's get into the deck, shall we? We run a decent amount of spider goodness using some gems as Canopy Spider, Deadly Recluse, and Spore Cap Spider for some low curve early game spiders. Grave Robber Spider has a neat little power boost ability that can buff it depending on how thick your graveyard is. Coincidentally, Nyx Weaver can help put more cards into your graveyard and can help return something from your grave to your hand if you need to. Penumbra Spider gives you a second spider once it dies, giving you double the value. And finally, perhaps my favorite spider, if that's even a thing, the Silk Lash Spider can clear away any flying creatures. A very useful card that this deck can take great advantage of to push through more damage is the Enchantment Assault Formation. This will put those high toughnesses these spiders have to better use, as rather than attacking using their regular power, which is frequently less than their toughness, their toughness will be utilized in combat. So let's look at the Silk Lash Spider. Rather than swinging in for only 2 damage, which is rather mediocre for a 5 drop spider, it'll be hitting in for 7, which is very tough even in Commander. This ability will also be able to help buff your creatures for 3 additional mana. So let's make more spiders. Two very useful cards that are pretty common at this time that'll be great in this deck are Spider Spawning, which will quite literally give you a ton of spiders, and we have Arachnogenesis from the previous year's Commander product, which will also give you a lot of spiders and has a nifty little fog-like ability. These two cards will give you a ton of little creatures to help make mincemeat out of your opponents. Now how are we going to make this deck even better? We have a selection of artifacts that will help enhance our army. Caged Sun, Coat of Arms, Door of Destiny, Adaptive Automaton, Obelisk of Erd, and Urza's Incubator will all help get your spider army amassed and it will make them bigger than your opponent can handle. In addition, the wider selection of cards we run in this deck contribute to help getting Delirium online for our commander. Now on the subject of Delirium, and before we talk about our land base, let's do a quick little chat about our good buddy the Queen Spider herself. Ishkana's ability is an enter the battlefield ability, so if you want to run cards like Conjurer's Closet, she would greatly benefit from those blink abilities that can abuse and reuse her ability many times over. Our small delirium package is in fact based more on getting extra added value from having it online and as such our commander will also give us extra benefit should we have those four card types in the grave. But that isn't to say that Ishkana can't function otherwise. If we can spawn a ton of spiders and have her in play, we can use her ability to singe our opponent for the size of our army. Put out Cryptolith Rite, perhaps my favorite enchantment from the Shadows of Innistrad block, 
and we can do it many times over, as our army of crawlies will be effective birds or uh, spiders of paradise. Speaking of mana, let's talk about the mana base really quick before the infestation of spiders drives me crazy. We're in Golgari color, so obviously swamps and forests and everything in between are necessary. I recommend certain cards such as Cavern of Souls to protect our tribe. Oran Reef the Vastwood will benefit our spiders the most, as almost all of our spiders are green more so than black. Urborg I will push into just about any deck that I can as it makes things into swamps and it'll give utility to lands that may not normally tap for mana. Fetches are also key here as they contribute to getting Delirium online and we want to do that as quickly as possible so Ishkana gets us that added value. We also want to run a selection of dual lands like Overgrown Tomb and Woodland Cemetery to make our mana fixing as smooth as possible. Also, I guess you could throw in a Soul Ring or two, whatever. And that's going to do it for this Commander deck tech. What do you think of Ishkana? Do you know of cards that would have done better in this deck list that we might have overlooked? Remember that the full deck list that we put together will be found down below in the description of this video. If you're new to the Planeswalker project, remember to tap the subscribe button and thank you, as always, for your amazing support.